Sure. Uh, my name is Rick Brigai. I'm an attorney in uh, Phoenix, Arizona. I have uh, an office in Albuquerque, New Mexico, too. I started coming here about 10 years ago. Um, it's uh, advertised as uh, sort of the, uh, the yearly event uh, for, for construction defect. And uh, I've, I've made a lot of, of good friendships here. Uh, I come back to see people that we work with in the industry. Um, we we, we uh, uh, are able to mingle with clients, with opposing counsel. Uh, we catch up on the latest trends in construction defect. Uh, this is a, primarily a California conference, and uh, w when case law comes out of California, it usually trickles over to uh, Arizona and New Mexico, so we feel like we're getting a heads up on, on trends here. And it's a good informal uh, uh, way to um, just communicate with, with people in the industry that, that you work with, that you see on emails, uh, and it's nice to put faces to names. Okay. Well, everybody is focused on cost and cost savings. And so uh, what, what we've done and what I've done is uh, developed a procedural process that shortens the length of litigation dramatically. Uh, we, we, even in uh, big uh, multi-unit uh, cases, multi-party cases, uh, we're, we're uh, implementing um, arbitration, uh, uh, binding arbitration as a method to uh, take cases out of the litigation process. We're getting these cases done in a year to 18 months instead of two to three years. Uh, we're streamlining discovery. Uh, we're, we're doing a lot to um, embrace the economy and, and the problems that we're seeing. Uh, but, but everybody is focused on cost savings. Uh, the building industry for sure, uh, and, and the insurance uh, industry too. And they're, and they're all much more concerned about um, uh, eliminating unnecessary process. And so that's what we're focused on. It's really interesting how um, uh, reticent the market is, and what I, what I mean by that are the, the, the insurance carriers uh, to, um, to think outside the box. And we're, we're promoting outside the box thinking when it comes to procedure and when it comes to uh, uh, making offers on cases too. And so what we're trying to, to, to sell, and, and, and I think it makes sense, is Let's evaluate these cases up front, and let's figure out what they're worth, and let's put a number to them, and let's stick to that number. Uh, uh, and in the process, eliminate as much discovery as we can. Why, why go through the process of many, many, many depositions and written interrogatories and all the nonsense that you see in these cases when we can figure out what these things are worth early? So the, the reception has been good, uh, but we're, we're ready to spread this message uh, even further. We'd like to see more acceptance of this, uh, of this process that we're talking about.